better now that we're together, if you know what I mean. Yeah. And I think you do. Uh, Donald Sterling, did you see last night the shocking, offensive comments that he was making? All right, I'll break that down. And Beyonce's sister bashed Jay-Z in the elevator. And um, that would be my top story, so let's get to it. It's time for Hot Topics. of the Wendy Show. I, well, here's the thing. I didn't want to miss a beat in the story, so I have my own notes, too. Okay, let's talk about it. All right, so the biggest story around the world seems to be Jay-Z being attacked in the elevator by Beyonce's sister, Solange. It's leading on all the newscasts. Of course, it's a hot topic here, but it's amazing how the world has let go of everything else important and is talking about this. She is kicking his behind. And the security guard's trying to hold her back. Beyonce's next to Jay-Z in the corner. And um, I know you've seen this footage before. and You know that uh, Beyonce waited a long time before she stepped in between them. Uh, yes, she almost kicked him in his area. Uh, but he caught it. Um, this was at, as you might know by now, the after party to the Met Gala. It was at a place here in Manhattan called the Standard Hotel. The hotel is upset because the footage even got out because this is supposed to be a place that caters to celebrities. But who falls for that? You know, of course, the, uh, this footage probably made somebody rich. <laughs> the only thing that would make somebody richer is the person who's got the audio. Yeah. Okay, so now, um, you know, I will just say that the people have been speculating and saying, well, why didn't Beyonce get in the middle? In my mind, Beyonce didn't get in the middle because Solange was probably attacking him over something that he knows he was dead wrong about, <laughs> and, and therefore, sister didn't get in the middle. <laughs> and a lot of people are also saying, well, Jay-Z really held his head because, you know, real men don't hit girls, except there's, there's some footage online of Jay-Z hitting a, a female fan back in the day. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> The legal team is up there going crazy with the alleged button. Um, the video, everyone, is uh, three minutes and 27 seconds. So if you'd like to see the whole video, you can do that on your time. But um, the, the bodyguard to Beyonce uh, stopped the elevator in the middle of, of, you know, going down. They were exiting the party, so they were on their way out to the paparazzi to get in the car and stuff. So stopped the elevator, and the fight went on, and I guess the security guard by not just... Look, Beyonce and the security guard were standing there like, this is nothing new between Solange and Jay-Z. You know, it, it, it didn't look like something new. I mean, it, it... Otherwise, wouldn't you have jumped in the way and stopped it if you were Beyonce? If this was something new, she just stood there in a very delicate dress. I mean, if she did much more, a boob would pop out. Because, you know, <laughs> she was wearing that, uh, that very revealing dress. Um, all right, so here's what I have. Solange's purse. You know, you see there at one point... By the way, at one point, I think I even see Solange spitting on him. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, Solange's purse right there is a 1.1-pound Anna Heimark metal bag. So it could have definitely done some damage if she connected with his face. Um, in addition, people are saying that inside of this after party to the Met, that Solange got into some sort of argument with the fashion designer Rachel Roy. Now, Rachel Roy used to be an intern at The Rock, Rock Aware, Rock, rock or whatever, back in the does A. And that, and that is when, that is when, look, look, I'm sorry, I gotta say something when I get in the purple chair, so I'm talking. <laughs> now look. Um, back in the day, that, those offices were Dame Dash and Jay-Z. This is when they were, this is going back to my radio days, you all. Oh. Come on, rock with me. <laughs> There are pretty girls and models walking all around there, posing as interns and secretaries. And it's also was known, I'll say alleged, 
for the legal team um, <laughs> that Dame and, and Jay-Z would pass girls around up there. Uh-huh. Uh, Rachel, were you one of those girls? Oh. Come here, Suzanne. Oh, yeah. I want to... I wanna... I want, to sh I want to give you an example of why it might have been that Solange came out of her face at Rachel in the party in front of other people. Because Jay probably did some stupid, slick man mess walking with his wife like this. Oh, oh. <laughs> How I'm doing? No, but you know what I mean? Like, do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like, I can't figure out how it is that Beyonce did not get involved with this mm -hmm. unless something happened to that party that Beyonce knows that Solange was right and Solange is just sick and tired of it. And yep. she probably went over to his face during the party and said something slick like, you know what, you're not gonna do this with my sister right here. You're not gonna do this with my sister right here, right? And then the three of them left the party and as soon as the elevator door closed, there's three minutes and 27 seconds of beatdown. So, you know, and then Dame Dash went on and married Rachel. So, therefore, you know, when Rocka Ware, Rocka Fella, Rocka whatever split up, Jay-Z's parting shot was, could have probably been something like, and I had your wife. <laughs> um, listen, this is a disgusting business. That's all I'm gonna say. This business is so disgusting that I can't. And people were accusing, you know, saying, well, maybe um, Solange was drunk and therefore went out. But when we show her walking out of the place, she doesn't look drunk. Roll that footage. She doesn't, let's just watch this together, okay? There's the security guard. She doesn't look drunk. She's not teetering on her heels. Her hair is laid. Shout out to her hairstylist. <laughs> now watch this, watch this, watch. He's not allowed to get in the car, and Beyonce gives a smile and gets in the car with her sister. Now, you can ride with whatever theory that you have about this, but I'm sticking with the Wendy theory. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> By the way, everybody needs a sister or a cousin or something like that in a Solange. So, you know, Solange, you know, good for you and good for your earlobes too, girl. Yeah, both earrings, you still look put together. <laughs> But you don't mess with Solange when it comes to Beyonce. You know that, um, or when it comes to her mom. The word on the street has always been that when Matthew came home uh, w with the mistress and pre pregnant with the little half-brother Nixon, that Solange took it to her father too. <laughs> the, uh, you know, you just, don't, you just don't mess with Solange. And I'm trying to think of what in the hell a sister is getting in the way of her married sister. Cause like, your, ma your marriage is sacred, you know? Your marriage is sacred and they're, but there aren't too many reasons, I think, that a sister would get in the way and start pummeling in a, in a public venue. Now, the elevator was private, but everybody knows the cameras are watching. And they were stepping out to the paparazzi. And Legion, this is Beyonce and Jay-Z. Like, like, I don't think she was out of her mind. I think that Jay-Z has done something really foul yeah. more than a few times in this marriage. And, and it is my belief that these two people, unfortunately, because I think he dips it where he works and dips it like in the industry, in my opinion. So therefore, when you go into the Oscars or you go to the Met Gala or you go to this party, it's not like random chicks. It's, it's there's Rachel Roy and there's this one and there's that one and, and no one. And this is not my last note, but this is the last thing I have written down on here. <laughs> Shut up, you guys. <laughs> um, Beyonce used to have a tattoo of Jay-Z on her ring finger. Show the picture and pull up on the ring. Whoa. Do you see? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I hate this show. <laughs> we are so damn nosy. Let's show the picture of a ringless Beyonce so we can pull up on that finger and see that the tattoo is on its way off. There's a little Band-Aid over it. Do you understand or are you just on? Am I like Angela Lansbury? <laughs> you know, I always appreciated Murder, She Wrote, because she doesn't use a gun, she just uses her brain and knows the clues. Say, I don't use a gun, but I think this is some pretty damn good detective work. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 
in conclusion, something smells very rotten in Denmark. And I think that all marriages go through stuff. And so they're, <clears throat> they're no different <clears throat> in terms of <clears throat> stuff than any marriage. But I think that Jay-Z and Beyonce, I wish that they weren't going on this world tour. I, 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 I think that they need to have several seats for a moment. I don't want to see them going to Nets games. I don't want to see them out for dinner, cook something. Or, or, or <laughs> hire a, I, you know, you gotta cook at home. You're like, you all just need to, you all just need to, like, I think, I think that they need to lay low. As much as we love to see them out and about, I enjoy seeing them at the games also smiling and having a good time. And when they're out with that little daughter, now look at her checking his text. <laughs> You see, then the more they go out now, the more under scrutiny their relationship is going to be. And that's not right because all marriages go through something. It just so happens that there's something is on a... a Sherry Shepard is so happy that this story happened. <laughs> Sherry, Sherry, Sherry. <laughs> hey, Sherry girl, I'm telling you. Whatever you and your husband, soon to be ex-husband, are going through, all you gotta do is wait a beat, and another celebrity does something, and everybody forgets. So Sherry is someplace like, thank God for Solange. <laughs> <laughs> um, it is a very unfortunate situation. I don't think that this couple is going to make a statement. Why do they have to make a statement? I don't believe that they have to make a statement. What are they gonna statement eyes? <laughs> you know, I've said what I said, and, and, and you'll keep talking, because we're all talking. It's the front page of the news, and it's the lead news ca cast on every sp news thing. <laughs> Solange, more power to you. Um, and Beyonce, I wish I had a sister who would fight like that. I mean, I know she would, but my sister's older than me. <laughs> And, and she'd be wanting to break, she'd be scared of breaking bones. And Jay-Z, no good's gonna come to you until you fill in the blanks. <laughs>